Saratoga has a history that's unbelievable and the atmosphere. Horses do great, the people do great. There's 20,000 plus here every day and, and it's just fabulous to kind of be able to play in front of uh, uh, an audience. All eyes and ears and everybody's watching what goes on at Saratoga from around the world. <laughs> the owners all want to win here. Trainers all want to win here. Jockeys all <laughs> want to win here. So everybody wants to win here. There's no place like it and it's just fabulous that it still is Saratoga and it's just great the way it's held its um, tradition. The more recent on-track tradition, just a mere 33 years in running, is Saratoga's annual open house. This year's event was festive with many families in attendance, but certainly falling well short of the excitement and capacity crowds of any race day. You never find empty picnic tables or the paddock saddling area as quiet as a Sunday service. Worse, the paddock bars serve no drinks and no patrons saw no horses get called to the post. Thus. No minutes to post or odds led to betting windows that were merely decorative, aching for betters to lay a few dollars down and scream at the televisions left over from the 1990s. The daily racing form and program stands seemed tossed aside like forgotten children's toys and weren't necessary anyway since the only games to play were carnival and variety that certainly had excited fans but who were paid off for their luck with small, furry stuffed animals. As the mythical dawn burned off into intensely hot and humid morning, the Phipps Barn accepted one, two, and then a few more shippers. And at the neighboring Oklahoma training track, some horses waited patiently for their turn to stretch their legs or breeze along like these two from Chad Brown's barn. Besides two non-wagering schooling races, the only real racing was reserved for equine artists offering their latest creations. But who knows? Maybe a champion left a hoof print behind and will someday join the hallowed names along Saratoga's new walk of fame and into the ever-present magical history that is Saratoga. <laughs>